have a coaching call today at 2 at 1 p.m. <laughs> so I will see you guys at 1 p.m. But right now I want to show you Lucerne Valley. So I think one of the reasons why if someone uh, comes to me and encourage and asks, hey Kim, can I can I start go walking the path where I can work from anywhere? The answer is yes. <laughs> so then talk about anything so they, this is the route that's next to me here right there. and this is the route I'm currently on right now and yeah just chilling just chilling on a Friday just chilling on a Friday Oh, do I? S so, am I still gonna show up for my coaching call for my Chrome Boss people on at one o'clock p.m. Pacific Standard Time? Yes, because the trailer right there has a reception. So, and I'm right now on a rock. <laughs> so it's kind of fun. Um. And uh, I'm like, that's an awesome business because for four days, he's getting nearly $700 for four days for someone to rent out an RV. And if he's booked all the way out to September with eight RVs, I did the math and it, you, it would take him around maybe two years to pay off all the RVs. Hey, RM. Muzami. It would take him two years to pay off all the RVs. At the same time, um, at the same time, he's renting them out, and he's making probably, I calculated it, probably around fifty thousand dollars a month because he bought eight RVs and they're all booked out. And some of the RVs are really expensive. This RV is smaller, so it's not as expensive. Seven hundred dollars for four days, so it's not that much. But during quarantine time, his business must be booming because people want to be able to get out, but not be in contact with a lot of other people. So um, a way to do that is here, where you're not in contact with a lot of people with a few people. At the same time, you get to enjoy being outside, <laughs> being outdoor, and enjoying some climbs before it gets too hot. Hey, Veronica. Hey, Veronica Rosales. Oh, are you afraid of heights? So, something about that. Once you start climbing, when I was stronger, I thought that not when I was stronger, when I was weaker, I thought that I was afraid of heights. And then you find out when you're climbing that you trust your body a little bit more. And you find out that maybe you're not afraid of heights, you're afraid of just falling. And if it's the case where you're afraid of falling and not of heights, and you get stronger with your body, 
then you're not afraid. You, you're not afraid any longer. So that's a, a mental transformation that happens. So, <clears throat> with that said, I am, oh, I'm running a, um, a challenge for people who want to create simple software, um, create passive income with simple software in August 10th. So if you want to register for that, it's a free challenge. It's going to be in August 10th and we'll teach you how to create passive income with simple software in the training. It's not a challenge, it's like a training. It's free training. I'm going to drop the link in the description later on. But for now, just want to seed that training. It's free. It's going to be August 10th and it'll blow your mind. <laughs> Um, hey Veronica, thanks. So, yeah, it's really fun. It's fun to be able to create passive income. So you can work from anywhere. So on a Friday, you can go climb, you can go hang out a rock, and then go back to your RV, and do your coaching call. You know, I'm still gonna do my coaching call today for my Chrome Boss people. And meanwhile, I'm hanging here. I also brought my little dog. Let me show you guys what's over here. What's over here? <laughs> Hope you are having a blast this Friday and register for my challenge so you can learn to work from anywhere and get passive income with simple software. Other than that, tell me how your Friday is going and what's going on in your part of the world. <laughs> Alright. Bye. Bye, Chris. Chris. Oh, hey, Anna. I didn't forget the Instagram. So Anna bought my Instagram post to PC software where you can post to your Instagram from your computer. Um, and she's like, where's the video? So I did not forget, Anna. You're going to get that video. It's really self-explanatory, but if, you know, if your users want a video or training, and it's not, it's really not out of your way. It really will help you and your users. Why not? Um, how are you doing this so calm? Because, because this is a calming activity. Well, at the top it is calming, but not while you're climbing. Oh, <laughs> I'm going live to my people. <laughs> on the phone. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, let's take this phone call right now in the <laughs> middle of a climb. <laughs> I don't feel so bad because there's barely anyone here. Yeah, I mean, no, I mean, it's a site a lot of people don't get to see. Yeah, most people, they think that this is insane. Oh, I <laughs> But for, for people like if we climb pretty often then it's kind of normal they're like how are you so normal why are you so breathing so normal <laughs> how are you breathing so normal up here <laughs> yeah, I feel like I'm still pretty new at this so I feel like my whole video would be <gasps> my breath it's the adrenaline pumping <laughs> yeah this is a calming activity Oh, I kind of want to share something else. So, no. The 
there's this thing I've noticed that people call out fake gurus and I think I think because so many people are trying to figure it out they just mimic what other people are doing and the insight I got recently is yes you can when you get started you can mimic what other people are doing along the way you find out your own path and you can teach your own exact path and uh and instead of mimic continuing to mimic other people you teach exactly what did you do to get to where you are and when you do that you create your own frameworks and you and you step into feeling no longer like a fake guru so i feel as if you're beginning it's okay to feel like a fake guru for a little bit until you figure out your own path then teach your path <laughs> then you will no longer feel like a fake guru and you'll feel very genuine and very congruent with with online teaching and i think part of the reason why people don't start is because of that imposter syndrome and if that's the case then you get sh completely shut down for something that a lot of the big gurus went through like the big gurus or the people who figured out it's because someone else taught them someone else showed them the way you know that's another insight i have up on this rock and i'm gonna go down now <laughs> i'm up here long enough <laughs> hope you guys have a good friday and for my chrome bosses i'll see you in the coaching call which i will do in that trailer because this is the trailer park life <laughs> bye Oh yeah, if you like that video, then you will love all the resources that I have over at kimcdang.com. That is K-M-C-D-A-N-G.com. There you will find all my courses, my extensions, all the offers that um, I have, as well as a lot of free resources if you are just getting started.